This is the strike clicker. Some assembly required. All polymer, put it up here and go. Boom, day is saved. They're coming right for us. Don't do that, you probably, you probably don't wanna do that. Fidget spinners, so I'm not gonna get me a fidget spinner. I'm gonna get um, something cooler. So I picked this up from uh, Strike Industries. Uh, Strike Industries, as you know, is a um, the Second Amendment supporting company that makes Second Amendment related uh, items. This is the Strike Clicker. Patent pending, pocket sized index finger trainer. So basically what is this? It's a little bit of a clicker fidget device for your index finger. Nothing more, nothing less. The interesting thing is some assembly required. So I picked this up off of their website. It's all plastic, all polymer. It's kind of like those um, those model cars that you get from Hobby Lobby. You pop it out of the plastic mold and then you put it together and boom, you got yourself a car. Uh, in this case, uh, we're gonna have ourselves a uh, fidget spinner type device or in this case, a clicker device. Without further ado, I'm gonna try and get this going and uh, we'll see how it goes. So I guess the first thing is to kind of just pop this stuff off so can I just break it yeah yeah looks like looks like stuff just just pops right out so uh, strike industries clicker rinse and repeat here this one just says the model number I'm assuming Las Vegas or something no, LV NV this is the trigger and then the something else so pop it out here Twist and it's supposed to be like that. So the instructions for this thing are right here on the back. Okay, so it says pop it out, of course. It has this little accessory bag right here. Pop that out. Uh oh, brings back some memories. I'm seeing some springs, some trauma of building um while building other devices. Let's see, it looks like you just loop this guy right here, this this spring. I loop that between the trigger and just called the hammer or something like that. This is not supposed to be like this. Just gonna trim this guy. So it looks like you just take this thing, and you loop this guy around it like this, and then you get this guy, and you loop it here. Oh, there you go. You're looking like something. And then you take one piece here. So it's got some uh, slots here to put these two pieces in. See, they got holes right there. It's got a hole right here and a hole right there. And then you got a corresponding piece right here and right here. Put them on in there. Boom. Like that. And then you take this bigger spring. See, there's a little divot right there. And then there's a little slot. Goes like that. I don't want to release this stuff because I know what happens when I do it when I'm building a lower. Hey, it doesn't end very well. Oh shoot, I'm supposed to put rubber pads. Okay, we have a little bit of an order of operations uh, issue going on here. So I was supposed to put the rubber pads on this guy. So tiny rubber pads. I'm put it on right here. I don't imagine it's gonna be super, have to be super precise, but you never know. Now back to this, we're gonna loop it back over, just like how we had it earlier. Boom, this guy goes here. Then this guy goes here. Starts to put some tension. And then this spring goes in here. Alright, then that's pretty much it. Now I'm just gonna put this other side here. It's got corresponding pieces here. Alright, so all I gotta do is get the four screws here. Pretty simple actually. I got screws here. Really complicated, right? Set. I need a bigger bit. Try this again. So, screw goes into a hole, screwdriver goes on to screw. And 
we'll just go around the perimeter one more time and we'll go snug them down all right and um i got it i think that's pretty much it let's see if it works so this is called the strike clicker it better click so it's like you know you can practice Anticipating, gotta get a nice smooth trigger pull. So yeah, pretty cool. It, it's really all it is. It's just a fidget device, kind of. Literally has no function other than to do that to annoy people. Nothing more, nothing less. You can put it on your keychain, bring it with you, go to the grocery store, waiting in line, or maybe, maybe, maybe you're, you're, you're in a survival situation and you need to send out an SOS. All you gotta do is get your uh, karaoke microphone system, put it up here, and go. Boom, day is saved. Or maybe, you know, you, you, you just be walking down the street and then, you know, maybe you just wanna get some trigger practice and down the street. They're coming right for us. <sighs> don't do that, you probably, you probably don't wanna do that in the middle of the street. Uh, let's look up this thing on the Strike Industries website. What do you say? I got my little computer right here. Let's take a look here. Okay. Let's see, right there. And this is called the Strike Clicker. Clicker. It's out of stock. I got I, I I saw this come into stock. It was it just out of out of the blue? Actually no, I probably got an email about it and I picked it up and it's already out of stock again. Target and strengthen your index fingers with the strike clicker. Ambidextrous for either your right or left hand. This pocket-sized index finger trainer has an average pull weight of two pounds, two ounces. Pretty cool. They describe it as an itchy finger fidget device, as a tension relief or fidget device. Have some fun building as assembly is required but annoy everyone around you with hours of clicking fun. Pretty much, I mean, you know, you, you in a line at the DMV and some dude's just going. Probably drive you crazy, wouldn't it? Average pull weight is from 15 pulls using a Lyman 7832248 electronic digital trigger pull gauge. Dog trainer clicker for positive reinforcement. You can put the a key, key ring here. The product contains chemicals known as the state known to the state of California to cause cancer and birth defects or the reproductive harm, but doesn't everything. But yeah, that's that's pretty much it. That's uh, as far as I can tell. I mean, you can see pictures of it here. Boom, put it on your keychain. Uh, that's pretty much it. Yeah, a uh, really, really quick video of um, assembly of the Strike Industries Strike Clicker. Pretty cool. Is it the best investment? Probably not. It literally is a toy. Will I be bringing this with me? Probably. All right, that's, that's pretty much it. Strike Clicker Pocket Size Index Finger Trainer Patent Pending by uh, one of my favorite companies in the 2A uh, world, Strike Industries. Pretty simple. With that, catch you all on the flip.